let us quickly look at increasing and decreasing square root function. The vertex is negative four, negative one. The B is negative, the A is positive. It's gonna be doing something like this. It's always decreasing. Let's have a quick look at that. When X is negative four, we should get negative one as an answer is equal to the square root of, now the A is positive one. It's like the one in front of this square root. That's how I know the A is positive. The B is this negative one in front of this bracket. The square root of negative one times bracket x plus four, which is negative four plus four is zero, times negative one is zero. The square root of zero is zero. And then minus one gives us minus one. When x is minus five, we're gonna get zero. When x is minus eight, we're gonna get one. It's opening like this. It is always decreasing. So when's it increasing? Never. I'm gonna put an L set. Find the interval where this is decreasing. The vertex is negative six, negative four. It is opening, the B is positive, so it's opening this way to go to the right, but it's opening down to the right, so it's going like that. Let's graph it, see what it looks like. When x is negative six, the y value must be negative four is equal to negative four times the square root of the x value, which is negative six plus six, giving us zero, the square root, which is zero times negative four is zero, minus four is minus four. When the x is zero, we have negative 13 point something something. When it's three, we end up with negative 16. All right, three and negative 16. When it is negative two, we end up with negative 12 is right there. So it's looking like this, when is it decreasing was well, decreasing for its whole existence. So it's going to keep going down like that. From negative six to infinity. When x is a member of, except a bracket, negative six to infinity, and then reject a bracket on infinity. Let's look at when this is increasing. This is opening up. It's opening to the right. It's increasing from the vertex to infinity. All right, the vertex is at three, negative three right here. It is opening opening like this. Let's find some values at three and negative uh, here is equal to six times the square root of the x value, which is positive three minus three is zero, the square root of which is zero times six is zero, minus three is minus three. It's opening this way, if we went to four, we would have three. At seven, we end up with nine. It's gonna keep opening this way. 12, we end up with 15. So it's just gonna keep opening this way. When's it increasing? It's increasing in its entirety, its domain. When X is a member of the H, which is three, except a bracket on the three to infinity and rejecto bracket always on the infinities. And then we press answer to see if we're right. When is this one decreasing? It's opening down and to the right. The vertex is at zero, negative two. It's opening down at something like this. Let me plot the actual points. Zero, when X is zero, we end up with negative two. It's equal to negative seven times the square root of the X value. Minus two gives us minus two. At one, we have minus nine. At Four, we're at minus 16. At nine, we're at minus 23. This is gonna keep opening this way. When's it decreasing? It's decreasing when X is a member of zero, from zero to infinity, rejecto bracket on the infinity, and then press answer to see if you're right. So that's it for increasing and decreasing. 